Logical block addressing is a common scheme used for specifying the location of blocks of data stored on computer storage devices, generally secondary storage systems such as hard disk drives. LBA is a particularly simple linear addressing scheme. Blocks are located by an integer index, with the first block being LBA0, the second LBA1, and so on. The IDE standard included 22-bit LBA as an option, which was further extended to 28-bit with the release of ATA1 and to 48-bit with the release of ATA6, whereas the size of entries in on-disk and in-memory data structures holding the address is typically 32 or 64 bits. Most hard disk drives released after 1996 implement logical block addressing. Overview In logical block addressing, only one number is used to address data, and each linear base address describes a single block. The LBA scheme replaces earlier schemes which expose the physical details of the storage device to the software of the operating system. Chief among these was the cylinder head sector scheme, where blocks were addressed by means of a tuple which defined the cylinder, head, and sector at which they appeared on the hard disk. CHS did not map well to devices other than hard disks, and was generally not used for them. CHS was used in early MFM and RLL drives, and both it and its successor, extended cylinder head sector, were used in the first ATA drives. However, current disk drives use zone bit recording, where the number of sectors per track depends on the track number. Even though the disk drive will report some CHS values as sectors per track and heads per cylinder, they have little to do with the disk drive's true geometry. LBA was first introduced in SCSI as an abstraction. While the drive controller still addresses data blocks by their CHS address, this information is generally not used by the SCSI device driver, the OS, file system code, or any applications that access the raw disk. System calls requiring block-level I.O. pass LBA definitions to the storage device driver. For simple cases, this LBA is then passed directly to the drive controller. In redundant array of independent disks devices and storage area networks and where logical drives are composed by LUN virtualization and aggregation, LBA addressing of individual disks should be translated by a software layer to provide uniform LBA addressing for the entire storage device. Enhanced BIOS The earlier IDE standard from Western Digital introduced 22-bit LBA. In 1994, the ATA1 standard allowed for 28-bit addresses in both LBA and CHS modes. The CHS scheme used 16 bits for cylinder, 4 bits for head and 8 bits for sector, counting sectors from 1 to 255. This means the reported number of heads never exceeds 16, the number of sectors can be 255 and the number of cylinders can be as large as 65,536 limiting disk size to 128 GIB, assuming 512-byte sectors. These values can be accessed by issuing the ATA command identify device to the drive. However, the IBM BIOS implementation defined in the INT 13 hours disk access routines used quite a different 24-bit scheme for CHS addressing, with 10 bits for cylinder, 8 bits for head, and 6 bits for sector, or 10 24 cylinders. 256 heads, and 63 sectors. This INT 13 hours implementation had predated the ATA standard, as it was introduced when the IBM PC had only floppy disk storage, and when hard disk drives were introduced on the IBM PC XT. INT 13 hours interface could not be practically redesigned due to backward compatibility issues. Overlapping ATA CHS mapping with BIOS CHS mapping produced the lowest common denominator of 1046 bits, or 1024 cylinders, 16 heads, and 63 sectors, which gave the practical limit of 1024A, 16A, 63 sectors, and 528 bytes, assuming 512 byte sectors. In order for the BIOS to overcome this limit and successfully work with large hard drives, a CHS translation scheme had to be implemented in the BIOS disk I.O. routines which would convert between 24-bit CHS used by INT 13 hours and 28-bit CHS numbering used by ATA. The translation scheme was called large-orbit shift translation. 
This method would remap 1648-bit ATA cylinders and heads to 1086-bit scheme used by INT 13 hours, generating much more virtual drive heads than the physical disk reported. This increased the practical limit to 1024A, 256A, 63 sectors, or 8.4 GB. To further overcome this limit, INT 13 hours extensions were introduced with the BIOS Enhanced Disk Drive Services, which removed practical limits on disk size for operating systems which are aware of this new interface, such as the DOS 7.0 component in Windows 95. This enhanced BIOS subsystem supports LBA addressing with LBA or LBA assisted method, which uses native 28 bit LBA for addressing ATA disks and performs CHS conversion as needed. The normal or none method reverts to the earlier 1046 bit CHS mode, which does not support addressing more than 528 bytes. Until the release of ATA2 standard in 1996, there were a handful of large hard drives which did not support LBA addressing, so only large or normal methods could be used. However, using the large method also introduced portability problems, as different BIOS often used different and incompatible translation methods, and hard drives partitioned on a computer with a BIOS from a particular vendor often could not be read on a computer with a different make of BIOS. The solution was to use conversion software such as OnTrack Disk Manager. EZ drive, etc., which installed to the disk's OS loader and replaced INT 13 hours routines at boot time with custom code. This software could also enable LBA and INT 13 hours extensions support for older computers with non-LBA compliant BIOSes. Equals LBA assisted translation equals, when the BIOS is configured to use a disk in LBA assisted translation mode, the BIOS accesses the hardware using LBA mode but also presents a translated CHS geometry via the INT 13 hours interface. The number of cylinders, heads, and sectors in the translated geometry depends on the total size of the disk, as shown in the following table. Equals LBA 48 equals, the current 48-bit LBA scheme, introduced in 2003 with the ATA6 standard, allows addressing up to 128 pi b. Current PC compatible computers support INT 13 hours extensions, which use 64 bit structures for LBA addressing and should encompass any future extension of LBA addressing, though modern operating systems implement direct disk access and do not use the BIOS subsystems, except at boot load time. However, the common DOS style master boot record partition table only supports disk partitions up to 2 TB in size. For larger partitions this needs to be replaced by another scheme, for instance the GUID partition table which has the same 64-bit limit as the current INT 13 hours extensions. CHS conversion, in the LBA addressing scheme, sectors are numbered as integer indexes. When mapped to CHS tuples, LBA numbering starts with the first cylinder, first head, and track's first sector. Once the track is exhausted, Numbering continues to the second head, while staying inside the first cylinder. Once all heads inside the first cylinder are exhausted, numbering continues from the second cylinder, etc. Thus, the lower the LBA value is, the closer the physical sector is to the hard drive's first cylinder. CHS tuples can be mapped to LBA address with the following formula, LBA equals a, SPT plus, where, C. H and S are the cylinder number, the head number, and the sector number, LBA is the logical block address, HPC is the maximum number of heads per cylinder, SPT is the maximum number of sectors per track, LBA addresses can be mapped to CHS tuples with the following formula, C equals LBA hour equals mod HPC, S equals plus 1, according to the ATA specifications, if the content of words is greater than or equal to. 16,514,064, then the content of word 1, the number of logical cylinders shall be equal to 16,383. Therefore, for LBA 16,450,559, an ATA drive may actually respond with a CHS tuple, and the number of cylinders in this scheme must be much larger than 1024 allowed by INT 13 hours.
equals operating system dependencies equals operating systems that are sensitive to BIOS reported drive geometry include Solaris, DOS and Windows NT family, where NTLD or Winload use master boot record which addresses the disk using CHS. X86-64 and Atanium versions of Windows can partition the drive with GUID partition table which uses LBA addressing. Some operating systems do not require any translation because they do not use geometry reported by BIOS in their bootloaders. Among these operating systems are BSD, Linux, Mac OS X, OS 2 and React OS. See also Block, Cylinder Head Sector, Disk Formatting, Disk Partitioning, Disk Storage Notes References External links LBAs Explained LBA and CHS format, LBA mapping, CHS to LBA translation tutorial, CHS LBA conversion utility, Microsoft article on 7.8 GB limit on NT 4.0, hard drive size limitations and barriers, upgrading and repairing PCs, by Scott Mueller. Pages 524 a Euro 531.